Good morning. We just got back to the property actually from Paragon Ridge Ranch. We spent a night over there, but they gave us the hookup. Chickens. So these are, um, they got them from a, oh, what is it? They're laying hens, egg producers. Yeah. We hold this dog. Ooh, this is nice. A little chicken palace. Yeah. There you go. If you can't tell, they, um, they're kind of like rescue chickens. They were at like a egg facility. What yeah, like a, a, I can't think it's too early. Yeah, <laughs> and we haven't had coffee. Yeah, um, we'll talk later. Yeah. <laughs> Do yeah. all clean. A little soaking. There. Egg production center. You <laughs> say, like, do you feel better now? Yeah, I do. Got coffee, eggs, some banana bread. I got my toes up here warming up. You warming them toesies? Yeah. It was a heck of a day riding around and having fun and playing baseball and football. and Yeah. We didn't get to play basketball, but we played dominoes. Yeah. I let y'all win. Um... It makes them want to play basketball, but it's always a good time. And um, yeah, now we got some chickens. Yeah. Christy did give us some other stuff too. We got like some jelly that she made. Um, jalapenos. Candied jalapenos, which if you watch the live, I think we talked about it. I love that. Um, There's three jars. I don't remember what's what. Oh, I'll have to go look. I don't know if you guys can see, but the pups are just watching. New neighbors moved in. Oh. What are y'all doing? <laughs> Say the girls are up here. Were you checking out those chickens? What do you think? Yeah. Goats are up here. You have all that green to eat down there. Why on earth you coming up here? <laughs> oh, yeah, they do not like stubs. It's funny. But, yeah, it's, they're probably up here. So it's 8.50 right now. We haven't gone down and given them feed yet. And uh, probably like, come on. Whenever they have all that food. Get him, Karen. There's, it's all green down there and you choose to come up here. Come on, girls. Come on. Come on. Look. <laughs> That's the best goat you can possibly have. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> when they run, they get excited and we'll do a little uh, parkour. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> they start kind of going sideways. What do you think, Bandit? Huh? They stop and look back, make sure we're coming. It's like Parker. Yeah. <laughs> doing ramping. <laughs> you don't see that too often in the overdose. Karen. They do that when they start getting some speed. They're like, oh. Come on. Oh, we forgot to grab a spool for them to jump on from Paragon. Well, we I guess a, we didn't have room. We had enough going on this morning, aren't yeah. we? <laughs> yeah, that's the story we're going to have to tell. Yeah, we would have filmed it, but oh my gosh. Yeah. 
<laughs> then they're going to get impatient and come out. Come on. Come on. There you go, boys. That's where you're supposed to be. You too, chicken. Come on. We got them all trained. Yeah. <laughs> come on. Good job. Stay. Girls, we just put you up. <laughs> Troublemakers. They act like they're just starving. Yeah. But again, they have all this green. Oh, they, they got have plenty. Hey, and they get this too. Karen. Plenty. I'm glad you're feeling better, Karen. Well, the downside of doing a reclaim project. Yeah, look at how much we got, which is great, but then also. Uh, we need the trailer. We need the trailer. So, my favorite thing. Load uh, and unload. Unload, load, unload, load. Story of our life. That's what, this is the part people probably never show. See, this is how much work and effort and time is consumed doing this. Yeah. Always a trip to the lumber yard. Yeah, and again, it's the most fun thing. We did it. Not a good workout after a day of riding. <sighs> yeah. Look, only one boo boo. I guess two, you got splinter. A little bit, got it there. Yeah. <laughs> So back to the chickens, our new girls here. Um, again, they came from a laying facility uh, where they only keep them about a year and then where their eggs like slow down. Um, Paragon has the, got the connection, hooked us up with it. So again, Chrissy was like, it's kind of like a rescue. Um, you can tell the hens they have they're missing some feathers on their neck from like having to reach out to eat. Little things like that. We're gonna get um, set up and getting better. A little chicken rescue. Yeah, we're just nice people. <laughs> so. Ooh. There's this little sore today. Oh, a little is not the right word. <laughs> I'm beat up. See, so you can kinda see their necks. Got some uh, high protein foods. To kind of get them all. Try to get them peeled up. Where they need to be. And then this way, this feeder don't take up any room. Just kind of throw it on the side, which is yeah. awesome. And they can all eat. There you go, ladies. And then even their. Uh, they probably little nerves. Yeah. Even their nails are long because they haven't been able to scratch and so there, there you go. go they're gonna uh, have they a gonna better life this, yeah make us some eggs and breakfast mm -hmm. yeah you're like what is this <laughs> and then there's a couple other things we need to do to the um what is this called chicken coop yeah we'll put a little roosting bar for them we'll put a ramp and mm -hmm. all that put some wheels on this so we can move there they go yeah picking it a little bit Getting that water. He is what, interesting. What do you think, Stubbs? He just always wanting to learn. He really is. Something new he's just very into. But he's been around chickens. There's yeah, chickens somewhere. Yeah, but these are brand new. Yeah, he's just... What is that? Are new chicken friends? He's just a learning boy. You gonna be nice? Yeah. It's funny, they would rather have the bugs than the... Uh, Protein mm -hmm. food. Yeah. Well, they're getting it. And uh, if you guys have been around, you know, like, I'm not a... Bird person. Bird person. But I don't know. I wonder if it's... I don't know if it's just like a... You have uh, no connection. But now... Well, these... This was they, their story. Their little backstory. Well, that's what I'm saying. You never had a connection. So with... now I'm like... I don't know. Got my heartstrings on it. Now you have a connection. They were really nice whenever I picked them up from the trailer mm -hmm. and just walked up and grabbed them. 
Yeah. I guess they don't like eating out of that thing, but they knocked it over and they're eating some on the ground. <laughs> they probably didn't know what the plastic thing around it was. Yeah. They'll figure it out. Yeah. But yeah, I just grabbed them, picked them up, and they didn't really do anything, so. We'll get this set up a little bit better. Um, yeah, definitely some wheels. That way we can move it, and it's not just going to be getting nasty. Yeah. And then they'll just be in here for a couple weeks. Until they get used to it. And then they're going to free range. Yeah. And then we'll eat their eggs, maybe incubate some. Oh, like, yeah. Incubating wise, but we don't have a rooster. I guess we do have a rooster down there, but he ain't really. Uh, he's got a bum up to par. leg. Yeah. Uh, but Paragon had a really cool little baby rooster. Yeah, he's not ready yet, but not ready yet. They said we can grab him if we wanted him. He really is not too much smaller than them, though. Mm -mm. They're pretty small. Yeah. So. So we might. It'll work. Next time we go over there, we might get that rooster. Yeah, we may go back right now and ride some more. You want to? Yeah, I'm sore, but I'd do it again. Let's and then go. one thing I just love about my baby, she got a little bit of food left on her. She always got a little bit of food. <laughs> always. Apparently your whole family's like that. <laughs> he just protect him. Those are your new friends? At least we have one guard dog around here. <laughs> Not you, Luce. <laughs>